Hi everyone, I just wanted to give you a quick um, update and explanation about the radar scope contest that I'm entered in that I asked for people to vote for me. Uh, radar scope, as you can imagine from the name, is a weather radar app, but it is much more than the usual free radar apps that you might have. Uh, those would generally show low resolution uh, that multicolored radar that just shows you precipitation, that's called reflectivity radar. Radar scope uh, shows that in a much higher resolution, more detail, and many other radar products as well, not just the reflectivity. Um, if, if you've seen uh, your weather reports on the news, uh, usually around the time when there might be a tornado and they will have the radar that is red and green, that's the velocity radar, um, and it has that and many other uh, radar products to show a lot of uh, different detail. Um, it's actually used by professional meteorologists as well. Um, I have a Radar Scope Pro Tier 2 now. Um, it's $100 a year, um, and the contest that I'm entered into... I had originally thought we would just win stickers. It turns out that the grand prize winner would win a year free of Radar Scope Pro Tier 2. Uh, like I said, it's $100. That is per year. Uh, so it would re be really nice to win it, uh, a free year of that. Um, I wanted to let you know um, my uses for it. It's not just to have fun with it on my own. Um, I am definitely still doing that and learning in the process, uh, but it will be useful for amateur radio emergency communications. As some of you might know, uh, we do Skywarn severe weather nets in which we report current conditions to the National Weather Service. Now, that's usually reporting conditions that we see outside, but in a situation like that, it would still be nice to have uh, awareness of what's going on with the radar to know when storms are moving in, um, when to activate our severe weather nets um, and deactivate them, uh, when the next round might be coming in. It's also going to be helpful for situations when we're providing emergency communications. We may be deployed somewhere um, so we know when to, uh, to, to pack things up or to move or something. Um, or if we're supporting emergency communications for any, uh, an incident that is caused by weather, uh, I can give you a, a specific incident uh, involving that. Uh, when Hurricane Irma came into Georgia as a tropical storm, um, the cold air that we had had in the days prior had ended up shutting it down. So West Georgia didn't get much, but we didn't know that at the time. We thought it could end up being more severe. We were called upon to activate. I was at Tanner Medical Center, and some others were at the County Emergency Operations Center. Uh, while I was at the hospital, I was listening on the radio to the Skywarn Severe Weather Nets, but uh, the room I'm in in the hospital is a very small room, and there are no windows, so I couldn't see what was going on outside. Um, and if I happened to step outside and let that door close... I was going to need security to let me back in. Um, so it would be really nice to have uh, radar scope there so that I can analyze uh, the radar conditions, uh, all of the different products, the uh, reflectivity and velocity and other things. Um, if you're watching this video, I've added uh, the image you are seeing as a screenshot from radar scope. Uh, and you can see some of the features that the Pro version has. Um, the fact that you can see dual panes on the left is reflectivity, on the right is velocity. That's a Pro feature. Uh, and that's not just pretty cool to show two things at once. It's helpful. Uh, for example, um, if I'm looking for a tornado in that image, uh, the, right, the left side will show me a tornado as a hook echo. The left side will show it as a velocity couple, couplet with red meeting green. Um, so things like that. You may want to analyze two different radar products at, this, products at the same time. 
Um, so that's Radar Scope Pro Tier 2, and that's what I can win another year of if you take a moment and vote for me. Um, and please also share this with as many people as you can. I really appreciate it. Thank you.